So. <laughs> yes, and I had I did have a word, and, and uh, if you guys still have something in that area, you can go ahead and um, release it. But I, let me just share this word as uh, during the um, uh, the worship this morning. Oh my gosh, my heart was so stirred by that worship, and I saw um, little Zoe Saris, and I just wanted to to speak a word to her and um, maybe she can get this word somehow. Um, but I, I just, I saw, I saw her uh, uh, just ministering unto the Lord, even as uh, she was, uh, you know, a, just a, a young, a young girl ministering unto the Lord. I saw her being used by the Lord in the, on the secular side, as well as the Christian side, that the Lord's going to use her. The Lord's going to give her downloads of, of music sounds from heaven. Amen. And she's going to be able to sing forth the word of the Lord and, and God's going to use her and anything that you may be going through uh, right now, that's, that's only uh, an assignment of the enemy to try to hinder her from her destiny. But God has great plans. And, and for her, he has great plans for her to prosper in everything that he have he has created her to do. And so we just declare that over her in the name of Jesus. And we just bind up any and every assignment of the enemy that would try to throw her off track yes. in any way that would try to uh, block she that which God has much. called her to do in the name of Jesus. She but I, I just see her. I, I see God using her she and and um, and um, the breaker and anointing is upon her and that she's going to break through a man, even in her own life. And she's going to be a breaker. God's going to use her as a breaker to break through the lives of others in the name yes, of Jesus. Yes. We declare that word over you, Zoe, in Jesus name. Amen. 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 Yes. Um, if I could just add to that, I just want to speak directly to Zoe. I just want to say that I love you and I miss you. But I also wanted to tell you that, um, you know, God put a song in your heart and you need to sing it out. Uh, I know you used to sing a lot of songs that other people wrote, but I believe that God has made you a psalmist and that you have songs within you and you need to release them because they will break the chains off of other people. And um, I sent you something in the mail and I hope that you received it, but it was supposed to be a reminder to you that you can do anything that you set your mind on. And I just wanted to remind you of that that you can do anything that you set your mind on. So whatever you have that you feel like is holding you back, it's not. Just let it go and move forward. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And also, also, I am hearing pertaining to Zoe, Zoe, the seasons are changing. The seasons in your life, those seasons are changing. And even as, as we were speaking earlier and, and your name came on the forefront, I began to see like apple blossoms just beginning to bloom, to burst forth. And at, at certain certain times, they are th those blossoms are closed, but you are at the season in your life where the blossoms are opening. And not only are they opening for beauty, but there's a fragrance in your life that the Lord desire to bring forth and cause it to be released in the earth. And as you open your mouth, that's where the fragrance of the Lord is going to come forth. So the Lord want to assure you and to strengthen you. And it may seem at times that the strength, the inner strength is not there, but Zoe, the strength of the Lord is in you. So arise and let him do that which he has purpose to do in your heart. And you're not too young. You are not too young to obey and release the sound of the Lord in the earth. Amen. Amen. Quickly, um, just speak into um, Zoe's life. Um, just, just recently, Joanne um, resent me a prayer that Zoe had prayed over Jacqueline um, several years ago. And that that seed in that prayer, it was not in vain. And and as um, Prophetess Minerva was speaking of, of this is a time of blooming, I also feel that that prayer, um, the seed of, of that prayer is also blooming um, in Jacqueline's life. And so I just want to encourage also Zoe to, to step into your destiny, into that calling that desire that you've always had to worship. I don't forget that. Um, he is your first love and, he's, he, he, and he loves you. 
Um, so continue to sing, um, sing those songs that he's uh, pouring into your heart. And I look forward um, to that day that you and Jacqueline can sing together once again. Um, and it will happen and it will be soon. In Jesus' name, it is so. Amen.